The Sidoria Karate Do was officially launched in February 2016 in Georgia. Having resettled in a completely new environment, most of the parents of our community were concerned about the future of their children. There was both the fear and the hope of our community parents about their children. A hope for a good life and the worst fear of getting their children caught up in unethical activities. The fear came true for some parents who could not influence and put a stronghold on their children. There are situations of substance abuse, burglary, and gang fights where some of our community teenagers became victims of unhealthy attackments. In the light of this burning issue of the community we live in, it became obligatory for us to think and rethink about the appropriate avenue where the children be engaged in a constructive way during their leisure, particularly on weekends. We started brainstorming, and finally after a long debate and discussion, we concluded as why not to initiate Karate Club and disseminate the skills that we learned in the refugee camps in Nepal. Us, Maranai, Group American Sitoria Karate Do, Koyek, Volunteer Prosiksan. Few of the instructors who were resettled in Atlanta, Georgia, consented to volunteer during weekends on a rotation basis to teach our children the art of Sitorio Karate. My name is Abigail. I come to karate to learn and get physically strong. I also come to get disciplined. Hello, I'm Sammy Aksuba. I'm 14 years old. I come from Snareville, Georgia, and I'm a student in the Dirk American Sitorio Karate USA. This idea was put into real action when we received a mini grant from the United Way through the link of Lutheran Services of Georgia. The LSG helped us in connecting with other community partners, that is Pastor George Torado of Memorial Drive Presbyterian Church, who was generous enough to provide us with a splendid space for conducting classes on weekends. The main objectives behind the establishment of Sito Rio Karate Do in Georgia are to share and teach the art and skills that we have come with from Nepal to our community and children and others. To keep teenagers active, physically, mentally, and socially. To teach self-discipline and respect to develop in students the essence of volunteerism, to teach them leadership skills, to address concerns like obesity in young children and teenagers, to teach them the art of self-defense, and to foster community relationships by accommodating students from diverse cultural backgrounds. My name is Frederick Alphonse. Um, both my daughter, Abigail, and my son, Nasaya, attend this program. Um, I have seen a significant change, especially in my son, Nasaya's behavior. Um, he's a very active little boy and we were looking for a program that would help curtail that energy and um, we've seen a, a great change even his teacher at school is um, commenting on his, on his behavior. My daughter also has shown significant improvement in her ballet and um, I think it's because of that it helps, that program has helped them to be so well behaved. I think this program should be well supported. I'm a parent of Azad Guragai and Ansu Guragai. Sitori Karate has been providing critical assistance and has directly benefited uh, my kids in maintaining their fitness. Dojo does not have any formal resources to fund for this program. There are 50 students who regularly attend the classes on weekends for free of cost. Therefore, the dojo's financial position has been one of the greatest concerns at this juncture. However, our parents, advisors, board members, and well-wishers from our locality have been morally very supportive. We have been able to stand on this solid moral foundation so far, but we have to seriously work on the sustainability in the context of our current financial status. Classes are conducted at the gym hall of Memorial Presbyterian Church on Saturday from 10 a.m. to 12 noon, and Sunday from 6 p.m. to 8 p.m. The dojo heartily welcomes every child between the age of 6 and 18. Parents are welcome to visit us during the class time and talk to our instructors if they're interested to send their children to learn the art of Sitorio Karate. The learning of Sitorio Karate is a primary concern. However, it has many byproducts that will have a great positive impact on our children. Yeah!